Hello and welcome to the lecture. So let me show you how to create a user. So if you're in PHP MyAdmin, click on users. This will show you all the list of the users. Well, there's a confusion. Sometimes you cannot find this user bar because whenever you are in a different view, let's say you are in the table, you clicked on database or you have clicked on table. You cannot find the user here. So you'll be confused how I cannot find the user. You have to look at this thing. Okay. This is a breadcrumb right it shows the navigation wherever you are okay you are in the table now you want to go database go level one up you have to click on localhost okay then you come to the home page of it okay the another easy way is to click on this home button when you click on this home button you go to home page then you can go to database you can go to table right here you cannot find the users the user will be found on the server okay at the server level when you click on it click on user then here you have add new user you can give the username db user one okay give the password retype the password and then you have something called as privileges okay what privilege you want to give you can check all and give that privilege to the user okay so once you generate that user i'm going to show you in the next section when we look at how to create a user how to create a table how to grant access for user to that table how to create columns how to insert those then we'll understand the whole flow of it but as of now in this section you will understand how to create a user and how to navigate to this section that's more important to understand because you will be confused many of this are people are confused here once they are in the table view they cannot find user so they'll be confused how do i go to the users tab okay that's basically coming up from here okay when you go to server you can go to users and you can start creating the users here there's also existing users here if you want to change the privilege you can go and edit the privilege you can even select this and you can delete them as well all right so this is the page where you can create the users and you can grant the permission all right so this is the way you basically create a user